In this video, I'll show you how to fix your LG remote control in case one of the buttons stops working. Usually it's the power button that stops working, but in case it's any other ones, I'll show you how to get rid of this problem. So first step, turn off the TV. Obviously, if the power button is not working, you're going to press the button on the TV itself to turn it off. Then next step is to unplug the TV from the power source, so from the wall socket. Then next step is to unplug every HDMI cables that are connected to your LG TV. Disconnect them all. Next step, remove the batteries of your remote control. Now press the power button during 15 seconds with the remote control having no batteries. Okay, keep it pressed during 15 seconds, then release it. Next step is to press each buttons of the remote control very hard during five times each. Why we're doing this is that sometimes you get hair, you get debris, you get dust going right under the button, forbidding it to make contact with the board. If one of these buttons don't make contact, it can affect the power button. So even if it's not the power button the problem, the whole remote control won't work. So let me demonstrate. Press really hard. I know it can take a long time, but seriously, just do it. Okay, very hard. Smash them. They won't break. Don't worry, they're made for this. Okay, it's better to take your thumb since you have a better grip and you can apply more force on them. Okay, when you're done, you're going to plug back the TV into the power source. Turn it on using the button located under t the TV. Don't use the remote control to turn your TV on. Then once your TV is on, put back the batteries into your remote control and see if it's now working. If it's working, you'll then need to plug each HDMI cable that you disconnected previously into your LG TV one by one. So plug one and check if the remote control is still working. Plug the second one and check if the remote control is still working. Sometimes those devices that are connected by HDMI can interfere with the signal of your remote control. If this trick didn't solve your problem, you'll need to clean the remote control internally. I know it sounds a bit scary, but honestly, it can take five minutes to do it. I hope this video was useful uh, to fix your problem that you're having with your LG remote control. If this helped, please leave a comment down below. If you have other tricks, please leave them down below. If you discovered one by mistake or whatever, you knew one that no one uh, knows yet. Leave a like, subscribe to this channel, and I will see you in the next video.